an NBA celebration of Latin heritage. We're proud to bring it to you here at 2K Sports. Joined by Hall of Famer Grant Hill, NBA champion Steve Smith, and our reporter, Ali LaForce. This is Brian Anderson. Well, Grant, the playoffs are on the horizon. We're almost there. Can you taste postseason basketball? I can taste it. I can smell it. I can feel it. <laughs> There's nothing like the NBA playoffs. The level of basketball is just incredible. And lots of teams have a shot this year. So it'll be fun to see how it all plays out. A look at the opening lineup for the Oklahoma City Thunder. Inside, we got Williams and Holmgren. Shea Gilgis-Alexander is out there with Josh Kitty, And it's Dort in at the three. And so it's Oklahoma City with it. After the Lakers picking up a basket just moments ago. And there's a whistle. That's going to go on Jared Vanderbilt. That's his first foul. On defense, the Lakers. Now Holmgren. Wood grabs the board. James against Dort. Low block shot. Buries the jump shot. A threat from every spot on the floor. LeBron still probably the toughest cover in the league. Pass to Holmgren. Outside Giddy. Screen by Holmgren. Giddy passes to Holmgren. Wood grabs the board. Trying to take advantage of soft defense. He might have gotten over eager. Vanderbilt, three-pointer. Can't get it to go. Missed his first one. Now Gilgis Alexander. Williams finds Kitty. Rejected by James. That was well timed. It's hard to out anticipate LeBron. Cobb, no good. The Thunder have gone 0 for 4, missing their first four attempts. And that one's good. Gilgis Alexander. That breaks their string of misses. Now one for five. You can feel their sense of relief. Wood outside. Out to James. Williams grabs the board. The Thunder have gone one of five to start things off. Pass to Giddy. Holmgren with the basket on the assist from Giddy, And that makes it a tie ball game. Now, if you're just tuning in, we've played about two and a half minutes here in the first. You know, since the Lakers moved to L.A. in 1960, they've had the most sustained success in the NBA. Well, think about this, B.A. From West to Magic to Kobe to LeBron, they always have a superstar. And NBA players love living in L.A. And the city loves basketball. And here in the first, approaching three minutes play. MP shot is off. Woo, blown opportunity right there. Won't get many chances easier than that one. The shot by Dort, no good. This is the shot they wanted to get. Right guy, right spot, wrong result. Wood, a screen on Gilgis Alexander. And he lobs it up, and Wood with the stuff. Oh, a tremendous leader. MP is always looking to get his teammates involved out there. And Kitty has got the ball here for the Thunder. Outside, Williams. Pass to Gilgis Alexander. Back to Williams. Kitty with it. Now here's Dort. Just five on the clock. Here's Holmgren. The Lakers with a rebound. Wood's got four rebounds now. And all quarter long, it's been the same story. Inconsistent with this offense. Back to MP. And MP throws it down. The pass from LeBron moves the ball so well. For Oklahoma City, they've gone only two of six from the field. Outside, Williams. To the inside. Here's Gilgis Alexander. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Gilgis Alexander's got five now. So confident when finishing. Shea Gilgis Alexander just attacking them inside. Down low. And stolen by Holmgren. 
Here's Gilgis Alexander. Five points in the game. Outside, Williams. Giddy passes to Gilgis Alexander. Five on the clock. Up again. Wood grabs the board. He's kind of lost his way this period, having a hard time getting anything to go down. Williams passes to Giddy. He's good with a little Giddy. jumper in close. Yes. Some guys just understand how to generate points. He's one of them. Now here's MP. We saw him with 39 points last game. Inside. And Cobb slams it home. They keep capturing the lead and giving it back. We'll see if they can hold on to it this time. Both teams putting forth their best efforts right now. This is the kind of game fans pay to see. Here's Gilgis Alexander. The Lakers getting their last shot to go. Stolen by MP. Rejected by Holmgren. Wow. I mean, the seven foot six wingspan coming in handy. Holmgren. Loves swapping away shots just like this. These teams have really gone back and forth. <laughs> yeah, five lead changes already. This one's going to be a battle for sure. MP against Gilgis Alexander. He shoots it. The shot by James, no good. High percentage look for him. But bottom line, they're not all going to go down. Gilgis Alexander with the ball. Guarded now by Wood. Pass to Williams. To the middle. Here's Gilgis Alexander. And it falls for him. He's hit three of his first four attempts. Attacking in the painted area. Clearly that was their game plan coming in. To the paint. Here's MP. And Cobb slams it home. Oh, look at the elevation there from MP. Showing he can get up when he needs to. The Thunder have got six of 14 in so far. Screen by Holmgren. Giddy passes to Holmgren. He gets it in there. They're playing great team basketball. It's good movement and sharp, crisp passing. And a look at how the offensive approach has been going so far for the Thunder. Right now, it's their passing game, and it's been on point. Doing a great job of moving it around and getting the ball to their shooters. Man, they're just having their way, bullying the other team in the painted area, imposing their will down there whenever they want. You won't see them miss that one too many times. Yes, let's look on the bright side. You got a great look. It's a play that you might want to go back to again. Now here's Cobb. Six points for him. Here's Reeves. Good, and the assist goes to MP. Rock solid screen right there. The defender got completely lost. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Nice touch on both ends of that alley-oop. Hey, when he let go of the pass, I had no idea what he was going for. The Lakers trail. You know, for my money, Josh Giddy is one of the most entertaining players in the league, Grant. Yeah, he has superb vision in the open floor, B.A. Reads the angles and sees how plays develop with ease. His teammates have to be ready for a pass from Giddy at all times. William's shot is good. That's 10 straight points they've given up in the painted area. Huh. Pass to Reeves. And the ball out of play. The Thunder will have it. And let's use this break to recognize your Western Conference Player of the Week, MP. Yeah, it's clear that he's a key aspect of their offensive success. His decisions with the ball are what creates opportunities for himself and the rest of his teammates. D'Angelo Russell, he's checked in for Los Angeles. And also a switch here for Oklahoma City. Joe's checked in. Giddy against MP. Holmgren with a screen on MP. Outside Giddy. Just four to shoot. Rebound by the Lakers. Vanderbilt's got his fourth rebound in this one. MP, the pass to Vanderbilt. 
Giddy against MP. And Vanderbilt slams it in. There's an example of MP making everyone around him better. Thunder with a lead. Pass to Holmgren. Dort with it. He's averaging more than 12 a game. A consistent threat on offense. To the inside. Holmgren, the pass to Giddy. Outside, Williams. Just five to shoot. Holmgren with a screen on Vanderbilt. Williams. The Thunder with another miss. It can be a little disheartening when you do everything right and come away with nothing. Here's MP. Pass to Vanderbilt. Here's Reeves. Outside Vanderbilt. Now here's Russell. Tightly guarded from the strike. Yes, on the jumper. In the pick and roll, we have to account for Russell. He's looking to score. Outside Giddy. The shot that time not on target. Some solid D from Wood. And here's Vanderbilt from the arc. And it's Holmgren with a rebound. And Giddy has got the ball here for Oklahoma City. They couldn't put the pieces together, losing that last matchup with Phoenix. I really think the nail in the coffin was their missed free throws. That's usually an ominous sign. You hate to lose it at the line, especially when you're getting what you want in other areas of the game. Now here's Williams, making a mark on the offensive end, scoring around 13 a game. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 3 from downtown. Outside Vanderbilt. Pass to Wood. MP against Giddy. And here's Russell. From the arc. Sinks the tray. Russell's got his second basket on the night. A volume three-point shooter. The coaching staff encourages Russell to fire away. Giddy against MP. Giddy passes to Holmgren. Wood grabs the board. Wood's got rebound number eight here already in the game. His inability to make shots has not brought this team down. That shows you their resourcefulness. Now here's Russell. Five points in the game. Down low. Oh, deflected. Here's Wood. Holmgren with the block. Yeah, just an excellent shot blocker. Holmgren is so good at using his length and timing to erase shot attempts. Pass to Joe. MP against Dort. Holmgren with a screen on MP. The shot. Dort's shot is good. And the Thunder lead by three. Now Wood. Vanderbilt, a screen on Holmgren. Back to Vanderbilt. Russell from outside. And that's not going to go. One quarter in the books. And it's been a close one. Thunder out in front. Up three. The Thunder. go for a different look here. Christian Wood is checked in for Williams. Vanderbilt comes in for Achimura. Reeves is checked in for Prince. And MP subbed in for Russell. Here's Cobb. He has six. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. It's going to go on Shea Gilgis Alexander. And the defense knows they got to cover MP very close. But he gets physical and exploits the coverage there for a foul. And with his team poised to take their win streak to double digits, a little added pressure for MP. Or just confidence. They're playing at such a high level. But then again, he's always confident. Reeves and LeBron fill out the perimeter. Jared Vanderbilt out there with Christian Wood. And it's Cobb in at the point guard position. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. And with players like Moran and Giannis last season getting undercut around the rim, 
Would you support moving the charge circle out of footprint? You know, B.A., that's a good idea. I mean, I don't see why not. The league wants more highlights and less injuries, so it seems to make a lot of sense to me. Thanks, guys. Well, MP in their last time out against the Nuggets was lights out. He had 39 points and made a good number of free throws as well. You look at his stats overall, he was just everywhere then. Brian? Great report there, Allie. It was obvious he could do anything he wanted. A fantastic win. Well, I'll tell you, he was enjoying himself out there, kind of like us here in the broadcast booth. And whoever was matched up against him wasn't enjoying themselves. What I like is they just kept calling his number. Sometimes we see coaches go away from what's working, and we wonder why. Impressive one-hand slam right there, VA. Man, as long as he's confident about it, I'm good with it. Maybe use two hands next time. He knows where he is. Now here's Gilgis Alexander. 12 points for him. SGA doing his thing in close. Playing at his tempo, his pace, he's been dialed in all night. MP finds Wood. Here's Reeves. Cash. It's MP picking up the assist. Reeves has got his second bucket on the night. They're punishing those late defensive rotations, getting good looks inside throughout the half. And here's Giddy. 15 in his last outing. Pass to Holmgren. Six to shoot. Yep, that one goes. Holmgren's got six points. And this is where Holmgren is such a scoring threat. His size can make interior shots easier to find. Out to the wing. Wood inside. He's covered by Holmgren. Wood misses. I like it. That's a great battle at the rim. He just couldn't finish. Hey, you look at some of the young star power on OKC. Grant, they haven't had that since the Kevin Durant years. Oh, VA. I mean, those KD teams were built through the draft. So no matter where they're picking, the Thunder seem to uncover gems. D'Angelo Russell, he's checked in for LeBron. And also a switch here for Oklahoma City. Joe's checked in for Giddy. Russell deciding where to go with it. And here's Kyle for three. It's rebounded by Oklahoma City. The Lakers beat them last time when these two met in Los Angeles. And last time against this team, they struggled with foul trouble. It led to an ugly loss. Really a game to forget, all because they spent most of it hacking away. Josh Giddey's checked in for Oklahoma City. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. MP, the pass to Russell. Back to MP. MP packs it home. Incredible performance by MP. He has been on a tear. And Kitty has got the ball here for Oklahoma City. They'll be off to Portland for a meeting with the Trailblazers after this one. And that game will mark the end of a four-game trip. Board outside. Fires from deep. Wood grabs the board. For Los Angeles, they've gone just 5 of 12 here in the second quarter. MP no good. Oklahoma City has gone 2 of 5 from distance here in the second quarter. The foul called on MP. That'll be a second foul of the game. His second foul in as many quarters. We'll see if he backs off or stays aggressive. Giddy against MP. Pass to Joe. Dort with it. Here's Holmgren. Vanderbilt pulls it in. Vanderbilt's got five rebounds tonight. The battle of the boards has been something to watch. Dort with a steal. Now here's Giddy, guarded by Cobb. And that one's good. Giddy. The Lakers call timeout. They're coming off a win against the Nuggets. And I think they were prepared to face pressure D. But that never materialized, so they took advantage. They came in focused and ready to play. And despite facing little resistance, they never pulled back. So it's the Lakers now. Following the bucket by the Thunder. And they'll get another chance. Back to Wood. Pass to Reeves. And here is Vanderbilt. Five to shoot. He drops it from range. Vanderbilt's got his second bucket of the night. Defensively, you have to tighten up on him or suffer the consequences. 
Outside, Williams. Here's Joe. The wide open shot is on the money. Joe's got five now. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. Here's Reeves. He's been productive, averaging just over seven points a game. Kicks it out to MP. Two minutes for the first half. Well, the Lakers hired Darvin Ham to be their head coach back in 2022. Grant, that proved to be a great move. I agree, B.A. I mean, Ham was an assistant for a decade in the league, earned his spot as the main guy, and Darvin was a really tough player, too. I mean, he went undrafted and won a title with the Pistons against the Lakers. And the Thunder making a change here. Hardaway's checked in. Wood against Holmgren. And it's Giddy missing. Los Angeles has gone one of four from three-point land here in the second. Pass to Russell. Outside Cobb. Now here's Russell. Here's the three. Cash. It's MP picking up the assist. Cobb's got five assists tonight. No hesitation from Russell. I like seeing him make quick decisions and take these shots. Now here's Kitty. He has a clear impact on this offense, putting up over 19 a game. And boy, has this been a competitive matchup thus far. <laughs> These teams have swapped leads seven times already. We're not even in the second half. Giddy against MP. Past Wood. Outside Russell. Outside Cobb. Outside Vanderbilt. MP, a screen on Williams. Vanderbilt, no good. Oklahoma City has gotten three of their seven threes to find the net in this matchup. Giddy against MP. Fires the three. And it's Giddy missing. The Lakers trail. Just two seconds between the shot clock and the game clock. MP, the pass to Russell. Back to Cobb. And stolen by Williams. Pass to Giddy. Wide open look. And yep, it's good. Giddy's got six. Now Cobb. And we're through the first half of play here in what's been a good one. Thunder out in front. Up three. We'll see you after halftime for the beginning of the third quarter. Welcome to halftime. Now, Shaq, you once said that all the real big men are extinct because you killed them off. That would be a correct. And taking a look back now at the first half of play, the Lakers find themselves in a tight one. They've been too sloppy with the ball. Glad you could join us. Ryan Anderson and crew are ready to take it away for the start of the third quarter. Second half of basketball is upon us, and we may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game we've seen so far. Well, the Lakers shooting 44%, a pretty decent clip, and on the floor for Mark Dagnall starting the second half. In it forward, it's Dorton Williams. Josh Giddy out there with Shea Gilgis Alexander. And it's Holmgren in at the five, roaming the paint. You have to admire MP's obvious love for the game. This guy just wants to get out there and play hard. And Grant, when you scan the OKC roster, you see length in every position. Yeah, it's definitely their philosophy, BA. We're seeing a number of franchises going that route. What I would say about the Thunder, though, many of their guys still have some strength to add. I'll tell you, he doesn't give points away. Excellent job from the line. Here's Gilgis Alexander. And slam dunk by Gilgis Alexander. Look at these numbers. There's a reason SGA is one of the best guards in the NBA right now. 
MP finds James. MP scanning the floor. On the wing, Reeves. Down to five on the shot clock. Yes, sir! LeBron James! I mean, plenty of lift in those legs. LeBron never did the dunk contest. He just does it in a game. Here's Oklahoma City now. Gilgis Alexander passes to Williams. Inside, Holmgren. Goes back up. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. Christian Wood picks one up. Had he played to stop that easy layup right there. I mean, make him earn it at the line. Yeah, many believe Holmgren must add muscle over time to his wire reframe. We'll see if he focuses on doing just that. Gilgis Alexander against MP. Here's James. Holmgren with the block. They get it back. To the middle. Second chance shot. Back to Reeves. For the lead. That's in. Coming off an assist from Cobb. Reeves has got seven points. Incredible game. This lead has been exchanged eight times. Tremendous show of will and resilience on both sides. Now here's Gilgis Alexander. Pass to Holmgren. Left side, Giddy. Rebounded by the Lakers. Woods got 14. Yep, 14 rebounds for him tonight. James with the ball, and it's Dort picking him up. James passes to MP. They double up Cobb. On the wing, Reeves. Back to Cobb. Nifty move. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. MP doesn't back away from contact. He embraces it when he's trying to score. Joe's checked in for Shea Gilgis Alexander. And Cobb drops them both. The Thunder have gone just one of three in the second half. Outside, Williams. Pass to Giddy. To the paint. Here's Holmgren. And the big finish by Holmgren. And you know, as a roller, Holmgren shows great hands, and he makes nice adjustments moving downhill. To the inside. MP right through him. He's really finding his rhythm here. I mean, smart move to keep feeding him the ball. Let him decide whether to shoot it, whether to pass it. He's your catalyst right now. Joe, the pass to Giddy. It's stolen by MP. Here's Reeves. Back to MP. Outside Vanderbilt. Out to James. Let's it fly. Good, and the assist goes to MP. MP's got his seventh assist of the game with that last one. And Kitty has got the ball here for OKC. It's a five-point game. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. Hey, Brian, LeBron James last season moved into the top four all-time in assists and first all-time in points scored. Not only that, he is the only player in NBA history with over 30,000 points, 10,000 rebounds, and 10,000 assists. And he's still going. Folks, what we are witnessing is legendary. Brian? That is the truth. Good stuff, Allie. Thank you for that. Shot clock at six. Williams from long range drains the triple. Williams has got 10 points. How can you leave this guy that wide open? Please. That's terrible. Down low. Here's Cobb. And if he throws it down. And you have to love it. The floor general taking things into his own hands. Just the aggression they're looking for, man. But not every point guard can give you that. The ability to finish that level of authority. A yeah, short trip up for Holmgren, but there's plenty of power behind his jam. The Lakers in the lead. MP outside. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. And since the All-Star break, here are some of the bigs who have shot the ball the best from outside the arc. A growing trend in today's NBA. Rui Achimura on top. Big men who can stretch the floor come at a premium. He's a poster child for that. If they keep hitting free throws at this clip, it'll help them seal the deal. And both free throws good for MP. 
The Thunder have gone four of six from the floor in this third quarter. Outside, Williams. With some arc. Vanderbilt with the block. Dort against James. Pass to Reeves. Over to the left wing. Vanderbilt, the pass to MP. Rejected by Holmgren. Williams against Vanderbilt. Here's Joe. Dort outside. Screen by Holmgren. Fires from the wing. The Lakers with a rebound. Here's MP. And it's Holmgren with a rebound. Holmgren's got a rebound number five here tonight. Kitty finds Dort. Holmgren with a screen on Wood. Dort, the pass to Holmgren. Up and in on the layup. Holmgren's got 16 points. A great coordination there. Holmgren is so effective in pick and roll and in pick and pop. Dort against James. Back to Cobb. Stolen by Giddy. Inside, Williams. And he hits it to tie the game. 12 points for him. They've now had assist on each of their last three buckets. The Lakers call timeout. Hachimura's checked in for Vanderbilt. And also a switch here for Oklahoma City. Hardaway's checked in. The Lakers have gotten five of eight shots to go in the third. MP, the pass to Reed. To the inside. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. That one on Giddy. First one falls for him. And both free throws good for MP. Oklahoma City has gone four of nine so far from the perimeter. From 11 feet away. And it's Giddy missing. Well, we've got a close game here in Los Angeles. And after this one, they're at home against Sacramento. James can't get it to go. The Thunder have gotten 6 of 11 attempts to fall so far in the third. Smitty, part of what makes LeBron James so inspiring is how competitive he is still. B.A., I don't think he'll ever lose that fire in his eyes. But you're right, he's still hungry. Every game, even the little ones, LeBron wants to win just as bad as ever. And this is what Coach wants to see from Holmgren. I'll work in the defense to get a second chance look. Giddy against MP. Here's Reeves. He's got seven. Hachimura with a screen on Giddy. The three from Wood. That's good. And it's Cobb with the assist. Cobb's got eight assists in the game. A big man with real range. Wood knows how important him being able to stretch the floor is. Now here's Kitty. He's got six. Pass to Dort. Back to Kitty. Shot clock at five. Screen by Holmgren. Oh, the Thunder, another three. And both teams running long-range plays that are working. How often do we see this these days? Clubs answering each other from range. Now here's Wood. He's got five. Cobb with it. Back to Wood. James outside. To the paint. Takes the hit. MP still gets it to go. They have leaned on him all quarter, and it has worked to perfection. Dort outside. Pass to Holmgren. Back to Hardaway. Down low. Here's Giddy. Damn, that one's good. Giddy's got five points now this quarter. They're finding ways to get the ball into the paint. Five consecutive buckets. James, outside. Oh, that's going to be too many steps. Gets the whistle on the travel. And here is our race for Rookie of the Year. You can feel the excitement around this group. So much potential. You look at Cobb. 
He's shown us throughout the course of this season that he's at the top of his rookie class, so it's no surprise to see him in the top spot. And there's no doubt he's the top contender. I'll be shocked if he's not lifting the Rookie of the Year trophy later on. I will be surprised given how hard he's worked, how well he's produced. This is a guy you can build a team around. And the foul called on MP. That'll get him his fourth foul of the game. And what a phenomenal replay of... Here's Cobb. Misses from close range. Oklahoma City has gone two of two from outside so far in the fourth. LeBron and Achimura are the forwards. MP is out there with D'Angelo Russell. And it's Williams in at the five. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. Oh, nice one-handed jam there, B.A. Hey, little exclamation point. Here's MP following the bucket by the Thunder to the middle. And the finish by Cobb. And this is exactly how Russell does solid assist numbers. I mean, just great delivery on that play. Giddy against Russell. Outside Giddy. Picked by Pokashevsky. From 11 feet away, the Lakers with a rebound. A little over two and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. Here's Cobb. It's tipped. Out of bounds as Los Angeles keeps possession. The Lakers making a switch here. Reeves is checked in. Joe's checked in for Oklahoma City. Oklahoma City on D. A great fourth quarter. Just giving up two points. Gets the three ball to go. And this is just typical of him. Always making an impact at crucial moments in the game. It's the fourth quarter and it's a close game. You want to get the ball to someone you can rely on. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. You know what? They talked about this at halftime. And they're doing a better job of creating space. Now here's MP. Takes it in. It's deflected. A look at the clock. A little under three and a half minutes gone by in the fourth. And it's Giddy missing. For Los Angeles, they've gone two for seven from the field here in the fourth. Not great. Giddy against MP. Pass to Williams. And they double up MP. Four on the clock. The Lakers got to get one up. Late clock. That shot wide open. Reeves has got six here in the quarter. And defensively, how do you leave them that open in crunch time? And Giddy has got the ball here for the Thunder. They lead by four. Hardaway against James. Back to Pokashevsky. Left side, Hardaway. Pokashevsky, the pass to Hardaway. Oklahoma City's got to hurry. they got to get up a shot. And it's Giddy missing. This has been a close game in a lot of ways, but they do have an edge on the board. Nice job by MP converting in tight. Love whenever MP is tenacious like this. Brushing off the defense like it's nothing. Kicks it out to Hardaway. There's the three. Achimura with a rebound. The Lakers have gotten four of nine shots to go in during this fourth quarter. Cobb drives in. MP blast off. And the work that MP puts in, it shines through during every hoop he makes. Oklahoma City has gone three of six from downtown so far in the fourth. Here's Giddy. Gets the bucket and the foul. It's on Rui Achimura. He's only one for four here in the fourth, but maybe that bucket will ignite his offense. Woods checked in for Los Angeles. Holmgren, he's checked in for Oklahoma City. Dort comes in for Joe. Now, here is James. Inside, Cobb. He blocks. Again. A defensive 
a stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Protecting the rim well. Love the hustle. All right, let's take a look at the energy stats, how the hustle game has been going for the Thunder. It's easy for me. Look at their defensive effort all game. The block total shows their commitment to contesting shots. And you got to respect their energy level. A lot of steals, staying active, and making things happen. Now here's Giddy. And the foul called on MP. That'll be foul number five on him. Well, he needs to be careful. Tight Giddy. Pass to Dort. This one for three. Rebound, the Lakers. Vanderbilt's got seven rebounds in the game. Here's Reeves. Five to shoot. Back to Cobb. And MP throws it down hard. No problem from MP. The bigger the moment, the more he wants to rock. Impressive looks on the AT&T 5G slam cam. Now here's Giddy. And the foul called on MP. That's it for him. He's fouled out of the game. They'll need to make some major adjustments to compensate for him fouling out with the game on the line. And yeah, the Lakers man. making a change here. Russell has checked in. James with a steal. Here's the break for the finish. And it's James with the jam. When you need a big bucket, keep it in his hands. LeBron lives for this one. Now here's Giddy. Tight defense on him. To the inside. Another possession, another assist. That makes 15 assists. He has been one step ahead of the defense all game long. Here's Reeves. Pass to Wood. Russell with the ball. Back to Wood. Clock at six. That falls. Nice assist by Russell. Russell's got assist number five here tonight. Oh, what a play by Wood. Getting assertive and finding his team those points they need. Now here's Giddy. Here's Gilgis Alexander. The bank shot, no good. Very surprising. He gets the ball where he wants it in a decent matchup. Here's LeBron over Dort. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. LeBron is glad to be at the line here. He'd rather do it himself than watch someone else. All right, guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for the Lakers. It's just a passing clinic from them in this game. Solid communication and unselfish play all around. And also, guys, great job hitting their free throws tonight, too. Taking advantage of those freebies makes a huge difference. He hits the first one, and that'll put him up two. And no one's more familiar with this situation than LeBron. This team leans on him even harder in the clutch. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a three-point game. Yeah, that's who you want stepping to the line when the game is close. Russell against Gilgis Alexander. Holmgren with a screen on Russell. Gilgis Alexander passes to Holmgren. Good. Holmgren's got 20. These moments are important for Holmgren's development. He needs to keep sinking those big-time shots. James against Dort. James passes to Vanderbilt. The shot's good on the assist by James. And the Lakers lead by three. This is who you want leading that play. A sure passer with great awareness. Russell against Gilgis Alexander. Pass to Holmgren. Cash! And that one brings him within one! 
There is absolutely no fear in his eyes. He loves the moment. Incredible shot with everything on the line coming through for his team. Now here's Russell. Good work defensively by Dort. 32 seconds left in the game. Outside, Williams. Gilgis Alexander surveying the D. Back to Williams. Gilgis Alexander against Vanderbilt. And he's doing things on the glass tonight that we don't often see. It's incredible, and I'll tell you what, it's a joy to watch. There's more to this game than threes and dunks. So the first one drops, and that'll put him up too. And he needs to find a way to deliver here. Not the best part of Wizards' game, but it's crucial. Second one is good. Getting both at the line. And it's a three-point game. Huge shots. Tremendous job stepping up in a big way for them at the strike. Now a timeout call by Oklahoma City. They're trailing by three. 11 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Guys, what do you think? Tricky situation here. They need some kind of bucket to stay alive. Also, interesting choice to be made right here. You need either a three or a quick two and a five. Seven seconds left in the fourth. Yeah, an amazing find. How about the patience from Door? Waits for his man to get open and feeds him. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over.
Wood, a screen on Gilgis Alexander. Pass to James. Over Dort. Oh, and a chance to win the game, but the last minute shot is offline. Regulation is ended, and we are headed to a... Boy, these teams have battled tooth and nail for four quarters. Now we're headed to overtime. This one should be fun. Now here's Gilgis Alexander. Inside, we got Williams and Holmgren. Josh Giddy out there with Shea Gilgis Alexander. And it's Dort in at the three. Pass to Giddy. And that one, good. Rock solid screen right there. So it's Oklahoma City winning this one. Things looked a little uneven for them down the stretch, but in overtime...